This video covers the setup for the LTS indoor intercom stations, models LTH D301GY Wi-Fi or LTH D311GY Wi-Fi with firmware 2.1.66 and earlier versions. Here we will walk through the seven steps of the setup wizard to demonstrate each one. To set up the indoor station for regular operation, follow the prompt to create a unique password. Re-enter the same password to confirm. Step 1. The default language for this station is English. If you would like to use another language, please select it at the prompt. Otherwise, tap Next. Step 2. Please enter an email address to use whenever the password needs to be reset. You can skip this step and return later if you'd like. Step 3. Enable automatic IP address retrieval by tapping the toggle in the upper right. When on, the toggle will change to green until an IP address is assigned, then default to gray as seen here. Once the IP address is set, review the prompt and tap OK to confirm. Step 4. Enter time and date information. Step 5. Enter your preferred settings for each category. Here, we select the option to use the same password we entered at the first prompt. You may create another password if needed. Step 6. Confirm whether you would like to enable mobile app service. To enable, turn the toggle button to on. It will change to green and corresponding information will appear below. Next, enter the verification code. The status will change to connected and we can proceed. Step 7. For the final step, we will pair or bind an outdoor camera station. Using the indoor station touchscreen, we can activate and deactivate the outdoor camera station, configure its IP address, and bind other devices to it using its serial number. By tapping on the refresh icon in the upper right corner, the serial number will be detected automatically. Verify the information and activate your device by tapping OK. Tap on the settings icon once again to see the network settings window. Here, you can turn on automatic IP address retrieval by tapping the toggle at the bottom of the window. Tap OK to confirm. Tap the refresh icon in the upper right once again to confirm the configuration information. Once confirmed, tap Finish. If the mobile app was not linked using the wizard setup page, it can be done here. Follow these steps to scan the QR code using the LTS Connect mobile app on a smartphone. You can now see the user interface home screen. The system will use default time and date settings, and icons will be visible for making calls and other actions. Let's tap on Settings to see the next steps. Tap on the More button in the lower right to see Advanced Settings. Tap on Configuration and enter the admin password to access configuration options. Tap OK when ready. At this point, we are in the Local Information page. Tap on the Tools icon in the lower right. This will take us to the System Maintenance page. Tap on Mobile App Configuration to return to the screen we visited in Step 6 of the Setup Wizard. Here, we will link the LTS Connect app on our smartphone to the intercom's outdoor station camera using the QR code found on the screen of the indoor station. On your smartphone, tap Add Device to add the intercom's outdoor camera. Select the option to scan a QR code. Use the phone's camera to scan the code on the intercom screen. Tap Add on the phone to complete the step. Tap Next and Save to finalize the addition of the camera feed. The camera's live feed is now visible in the screen on our smartphone. Tap the back arrow in the upper left corner of the intercom to return to the home screen. Next, we will check the feed by tapping on the Live View icon on the home screen. Tap on the camera feed tile containing the play button icon and the words Outdoor Station. You can now see the live feed from the intercom's outdoor camera. Return to the home screen by tapping the back arrow in the upper left. Now, tap on the Outdoor Station Call button to call the indoor intercom. On the indoor intercom home screen, you will now see the live feed from the camera and hear the ringtone. Three buttons will appear, the blue Key button, the red End Call button, and the green Answer button. The indoor intercom station is now operational. To learn more, 
contact your local LTS sales representative or visit us at ltsecurityinc.com. Thank you for watching.